Hi, friend. I am live. Oh, look. You're grabbing a mic. <laughs> We're talking. Yes. So, you play an instrument, the fiddle, that matters a great deal in the, orca- the organic, natural history of country music. Yeah. You're one of my favorite musicians in town. Oh, my gosh. I told I Derek Wells that. that recently about you. Oh, my God. Thank so, you. So, you're an award winner, too. Take me into being a session musician, largely, when you win an award and you go into a room and there's an artist that you know could win an award and you're going to help them get there. Oh, my gosh. Um, it, it's, uh, <laughs> you know, I always say the song tells me what to play. And right. So when I'm in those scenarios, like uh, whatever I'm hearing com- coming out of those speakers, that's 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 what I lean to and, and what it tells me to play. And these amazing songwriters and singers I mean my gosh the inspiration I hear coming through those headphones and there are people that I think of Trisha Yearwood Reba and and it just I sit in my chair sometimes and go it's 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 I'm truly living my dream getting to play behind all of these artists um that's what I've dreamed of doing my whole life so yeah absolutely it's inspiring so a thing that I'm very hopeful for in country music is a bluegrass revival well, did I talked I tell to Appalachian you? Roadshow recently yeah. and had a whole conversation with Jim Van Cleve about it. Oh, love Jim. Yes. So, talk to me about that, why that's important. Well, I should tell you that why I said that, I didn't know if you know I was starting a bluegrass band. I mean, I know things. <laughs> okay, I was like, you These are all yeah. questions I ask for reasons. Okay. Well, it's being backstage tonight and doing rehearsal, there are so many fiddle players here, which makes me so excited. Um, there's some upright bass players here, some yes. of my dear friends. And uh, it feels like it feels like it might be time <laughs> for this. That's bluegrass. why I had to ask you. So, um, yeah, but I uh, there's a group of musicians we've been playing together: Josh Martin, Barry Bales, Seth Taylor, and Matt Menifee. And that sounds like a win. We're recording a project, and um, yeah, so we're looking. It's a lot of stuff I've written, a lot of stuff Josh has written, and um, so yeah, we're going to be releasing a single before long. So y'all keep your ears peeled <laughs> absolutely so for the people out here because there's a lot of people who are brand new to country music yeah i swear to god it's 100 years old but oh people are still brand yeah, new yeah explain to people the most important fiddle song in country music and why oh my gosh um you know i mean of course we all think no of, like like the, obviously the most make the, literally the most obvious answer well they went down to georgia of there course. it is yeah yeah thank you <laughs> Thank you. Yeah. I wasn't going to guide you on that one. No. I knew you had it. Well, yeah. I mean, (laughs) in fact, I was talking backstage to some musicians, and they were singing a fiddle player was in the band, and they didn't normally have a fiddle fiddle player. And they made so much more money playing at their gig because they could play Devil Went Down to Georgia. It's the perfect close, right? I know. Perfect closer. We really need to have them in our band. I love it. Yeah. Anyway. Cool. Well, as far as questions, that's what I had. I appreciate your time. I look forward to seeing more of you. I appreciate it. Absolutely. Thank you. you. Of course. (laughs)